What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel and in this new video. Today I'm here in this amazing corner of Dolomites and this is the second episode of a beautiful partnership with the tourist board of San Vigilio di Marebbe, one of the most amazing areas in the Dolomites and in this couple days I'm gonna explore a bit of the area and enjoy some amazing mountain views. Before starting my adventure, I spent some time visiting the beautiful little village of Lunjaru, the starting point of my hike. Lunjaru is located in a pristine mountain valley at the edge of Puet Sodle Nature Park in the Dolomites. Here you can find some perfect examples of the rural architecture, called villas, the old traditional settlements where local people still live. Another interesting thing to do is to walk through the Val di Morins, a short trail that follows a river where eight old water mills are set. It's like going back in time. Thanks to its authentic beauty and the spectacular place where it's located, in 2018 Lunjaru was named among the mountaineering villages, a collective of locations where harmony between man and nature is essential for its development. It's such a perfect place to isolate from everyday life and explore the wonderful surroundings. So today I'm hiking to the top of that mountain over there called Crep d'Ales Dodesk. Two hours hiking and I reached this amazing wide valley. You can see a tiny hut in the distance called Antersask. Awesome sharp peaks in this direction and our goal is that mountain over there. Crep Nales Dodesk. One hour. After three hours hiking, I just made it to the top and it's a spectacular viewpoint all over the Dolomites. So let's have a look. There's Lunjaru down in the valley, Sas de Putia or Peitlerkofel with Austrian glacier mountains in the background. Then there's Puets group over there. On the other side, Valbadia with Lavarella, Sas de la Cruz, Cima 10, Cima 9, uh, Zeekofel or Croda del Becco. And yeah, it's amazing.
sunset is over. Now it's time to hike down to Lunjaru and have some rest because tomorrow morning it's gonna be tough. Uh, the plan is very ambitious. I'm gonna leave as early as possible in the morning, way before sunrise, to hike all the way up this valley and reach the top of Pizduleda, which is one of those mountains. It's one of the highest peaks in the area. And from there, there is a spectacular view towards Puetzotl group on the west and towards the other Dolomites on the east. I'm not planning to be there for sunrise because it's a four hour hike, so it's almost impossible. But I'll try to be up as early as possible to get the best light. So it's gonna be great. Good morning. I left a couple hours ago down in Lunjaru and I've been hiking all the way up this magical valley. It's just amazing. I have no other way to describe it. Now it's sunrise time. I'm at Medalgas Alm and my goal is right over there. So I'm gonna hike up to that saddle and then up to the top.
10 a.m. Four and a half hours hiking and I'm on top of Pits du Leda 2,909 meters Whew. It's time for a well-deserved lunch. All right, lunch is done and another adventure in the mountains is almost over. I'm hiking back down to Lunjaru and we'll have a little bit of rest. It's been a pretty hard couple days, so I think I kind of deserve it. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. I've been really happy to finally explore this area because it was on my bucket list for such a long time. So yeah, from the mountains of San Vigilio di Marebbe, see you in the next adventure.